1.30 in the morning. I got off of work almost an hour before closing. I still had to do five shows. It was a good night. Besides the fact that there wasn't a lot of people in the restaurant, but there were quality people because they tipped. And not everybody, but a lot of them tip and it was a good night. And there was Armenians in tonight, so it was fun because they know how to party. And I was able to get back to California at a pretty decent hour. I normally roll up back to California around 3.30 in the morning, but I'll get home before two, which is pretty good. I'll get home a quarter to two, so that's very unheard of. I'm gonna be back in Santa Monica for 16 days, and the next time I'm in Las Vegas, it'll be February, and it'll be for 10 days straight of dancing, and then I will be gearing up to head to Costa Rica and Brazil. So it's gonna be a very busy month prior to me traveling, and I wanna try to take a trip in the next couple of days for like two nights to film for the channels. So we'll see if I can make that happen. So we are just 14 minutes away from home. I already know the patio is gonna be crazy looking. I have to unload the whole car, shower and get to bed. I don't have to get up early tomorrow morning or this morning. I do have to teach my virtual client of the day in that evening, afternoon. So it's just a work from home day. I'm gonna create art because I am doing three pop-ups this week and three pop-ups next week. So I wanna create some art and post more things for sale online. So that is the goal. And at some point film Thursday's check-in in the next two days. All right, it's 1.40 in the morning and we are back in the bubble. Give this video a big thumbs up. I will pick up the vlog in a couple of hours. All right, good morning vlog. So I wanna show you my little haul that I'm sending out to my Patreon member, subscriber, Mary in Texas. She's bought a lot of my big pieces, but this time she's um, gonna be getting a bunch of stuff from my grandma's handmade goods. So she has three aprons here, all with the bow and ruffle on the pocket. And then these two plant print lap blankets and then for being a patreon member she gets benefits so that is my thank you gift from my patreon and then my card so i'm gonna mail this out today thank you mary All right, shout out to grandma it's uh editing and taking care of my grandma booking flights and you know all that stuff so we're here and we're home this is like a orzo situation from trader joe's salmon and then there's some brown and white rice, some furikake. No vegetables, Grammy? I figured a vegetable all in there. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, big shout out to my Patreon subscriber, Cheryl. And she's been supporting the shop and the small businesses, my art, my grandma's sewing for a while. And I'm gonna be shipping out this mask for her. So thank you, Cheryl, so much for supporting. Good morning vlog. The sun is hiding behind the clouds. It should be coming out this afternoon. It is a quarter after nine. I just went to the post office to mail out some orders. Thank you guys. And now we're gonna go get the car wash because it's Wednesday. They have a car wash special. I think it's like $20, something like that for a hand wash. And then we're gonna go home and then I need to film Thursday's check-in. So that's kinda the plan for the next few hours. I do have to load up my car because tomorrow is the first pop-up of the week. And that is from 12 to five tomorrow. So. All right, back at the car wash. Nobody wants to get their car washed. Grandma and Abby's waiting behind this building. I'm gonna go and pay and sit and wait with them. There's my girls. Say hi to the vlog, Grandma. And look at the begonia blooms. I want to pluck them and save them all. All right, my favorite greenhouse. Let's see what's going on. Quick little stop. On the way home from the car wash. Wow, look at this stingray. That is huge. This is going for uh, over $200. Wow, look at this spider plant. Look at all the babies. Wow, that is huge. 
looks like some kind of hoya. Look at the basket it's in. That's so cool. I don't know what the price is on this one. And on Sonia. Beautiful monsteras. Ferns. Ooh, look at how big the Sensevaria Wilfins are. I don't know what they're going for, the price. It looks like they just propagated it. No price. That is a huge fan. Take a look at that. Arrowheads, Sagoniums, more Sensevarias. Wow. These Sensevarias are going for over $200. Look how pretty. Wow, bromeliad in bloom. Take a look at that. So pretty. Beautiful fern. Orchids. Look at the way how it's staked up. That's how mines look. And then it just, like, not happy. String of hearts. Look at the way how they styled this. Ripsalis. Silver satin. Okay, look at this. They have a little enclosure. I see a friend there. That's new. Only one of you in there? His colors are right. cool. I love that Stapelia. It's big and chunky. I have a lot, but that one is super cool. I wonder how much that one is. There's another one over here too. Wow, these are going for 40. That seems so expensive. One of my favorite Ripsalises. Oh. Here's another Stapelia. Look at this. Almost about to bloom. How much are these ones going for? Wow. Super expensive. Alright, looks like they changed things around since the last time I've been here. Take a look at that. The big stack horn. I think that's the Ripsalis I was eyeing out over a year ago. Okay, they now have a chicken enclosure. Look at this. <laughs> They're fluffy. Alright, I need to think about that. Because I think I have that plant. Okay, vlog. It is a quarter to 11. And I basically spent the morning running around doing errands. And I really, really want to go and do a yoga class. I told my yoga teacher that I really want to try to come three times a week with my schedule when I'm in town and I'm gonna try to do two this week so today and Friday morning in two days but this morning I went to the post office mail out orders I got my car washed and I have to take my grandma to open up a bank account here in two hours so I'm like you know what let me go and do a quick yoga class I usually like to go to the 7 a.m. class because that's the class time I've always been going all these years because it's from 7 to 8.30 and then I have the whole day ahead of me. So to do a class midday is going to be kind of weird for me. But I want to do a class. And then when I'm done with taking my grandma to her appointment for opening up a bank account, then I'm going to come home do my makeup, film Thursday's check-in, film that video, load up my car, edit Thursday's check-in, and upload it and pour resin at some point. So, very busy day. All right, yoga mat in hand. Oh my goodness, give this video a big thumbs up. It's been a minute. It's been forever, but I'm here and I'm going. Oh my goodness, I need this. Yay. Made it. All right, I did it. Yoga class was amazing. Thank you, Jerome. Now to continue on with my day.
Alright, so I think this is the plant right here. Yeah, star sarcostema. This is the same plant that I seen. But mine's is not that big compared to that, but slow grower. made plant-based patties, uh, cream of mushroom and rice, zucchini mushrooms, and then we have corn coming. Thanks, Graham, for dinner. Just finished my monthly meeting virtual.